I'm here because uh, the genocide that's being committed by Israel is a, you know, it's a crime against humanity. So I don't think that is a fight that we can leave to the Palestinians to fight it alone, you know. And me being here, you know, um, being from the Netherlands, I think it's uh, my obligation to be here and to raise my voice against genocide. And I think that the whole world should be appalled by what is going on. So, you know, and I think that I have the privilege uh, to uh, to live not far from here and to come here and show my support. You know, I think that a lot of people, millions of people would like to take the plane and be present at this moment, at this time and uh, at this place. So, yeah, you know, uh, I think that also it's important to show solidarity. Uh, you know, uh, a crime committed against one of us is a crime committed against all of us. So for me being here, it's nothing but, uh, but me doing my job and doing what I think the next generation expect, will expect for me to do. I am coming from England, standing with our brothers and sisters in the Netherlands, supporting South Africa's case of genocide against Israel, which has stolen the lives of at least 22,000 Palestinians, including a minimum of 8,000 children since October the 7th. We are standing in our thousands and in our millions, regardless whether they are Palestinian, regardless of whether they are Muslim, we are here because this is a human injustice and we are standing here as human beings calling out Israel's genocide. نحن باسم تنسيقية التوارئ من بلجيكا نسقنا مع مجموعة من الدول الأوروبية منها فرنسا وهولندا للحضور أمام المحكمة الهاي دعما للقضية اللي رفعتها جنوب إفريقيا ودعمتها بوليفيا ومجموعة من الدول الأخرى عشان يعني إنه ندعم ونسبة وجودنا وندعم يعني كل الدول اللي شاركتنا لعل وعسى إنه تصبح سابقة قانونية وتتبعها كل الدول الأخرى كنوع من أنواع الإحراج للدول الأوروبية الأخرى التي لم تلتحق بهاي القضية وآملين إنه وجودنا هون يكون له وقع وتأثير في الرأي العام الأوروبي ويستقبل أكبر عدد ممكن من المتضامنين اليوم نحن بندافع عن قضية حق قضية عدالة ولازم صوتنا يوصل ويكون مسموع وندعم كل الأطراف اللي بتدعم قضية Déjà symboliquement parce que c'est important d'être présent aujourd'hui pour la charge symbolique et aussi parce que c'est un moment d'histoire. Et si je suis venue aujourd'hui, c'est parce que moi j'estime que j'ai une responsabilité vis-à-vis -vis des générations futures. Demain, nos enfants nous demanderont qu'est-ce qu'on faisait pendant qu'un génocide avait lieu à Gaza. Et moi j'ai envie d'être du bon côté de l'histoire. Je sais que je le suis. Et venir ici, c'est important parce que. Un message à nos amis, à nos familles qui sont à Bruxelles. Ça leur permet aussi de se rendre compte de la réalité de ce qui se passe. En fait, beaucoup nous ont envoyé un petit peu en éclaireur parce qu'ils veulent savoir ce qui se passe ici, parce qu'ils suivent même depuis la maison, depuis leur lieu de travail. Le monde est un peu rivé sur Den Haag aujourd'hui et c'est pour ça que je suis venu. We should all be here. And I'm here against all the motherfuckers with Dutch flags here because I'm ashamed. Same from the Netherlands that there's so many Israeli flags and Dutch flags in my country. That's why I'm here. Uh, standing here today in solidarity with the Palestinians. Uh, we're standing in support of the South African uh, attempt to hold Israel responsible for its terror against the Palestinian population. We're also here in support. Uh, of the Palestinian resistance fighting back against uh, Israeli uh, attacks uh, and we're here also to hold the Dutch state complicit and accountable for the continuing st support uh, for the, the Israeli bombardment. Um, the Netherlands still sends particle weapons to the Israeli state. We, we need to stop it, we need to break all ties with, um, with the Israeli state. Um, ministries, uh, universities, uh, Israeli companies, we all need to break those ties. So that's why I'm here today. We are here because for the first time in 70 years, as Palestinians, we have a chance to get the justice that we deserve. 
I am personally here to represent my patients, the children that I have operated on, and those that I have lost have the right to expect justice from this world. And that's why we decided to come here to the ICJ to support South Africa's bid for justice for the 10,000 Palestinian children who were killed, for the over 22,000 Palestinians that were killed, 57,000 who were injured. All of them deserve this justice and hopefully today and tomorrow they'll have their day in court. <laughs> احنا من امام المحكمة الجنائية الدولية بالتضامن مع اهلنا في فلسطين وقطاع غزة ضد الاباده الجماعيه في قطاع غزه وفلسطين